What's up, Tubesters? Got me a new subscriber, actually. <laughs> What's good? I got these JBL GTO 609C Grand Touring Series separates. Six and a half separates. They're going in my 96 Impala SS. Uh, I was going to do three way six and a half. But I saw these on Amazon for less than $100, so I wanted to check the quality. I heard them. Somebody did a review, and uh, I think it was a little Toyota or something, but uh, they sounded loud and clear. So this is all I really needed for the rear doors. Uh, I got full cal separates in the front and infinity cap of 6 by 9 in the rear. So I think these will fill up the rear doors pretty good. Uh... Let's see what they look like. Again, it's JBL GTO 609C Grand Touring Series. On this manual. Okay. Sound like they got some hardware in here. Put this over here. Maybe I should keep it like this and flip it. Yeah, there we go. Okay. I guess there's different mounts for the uh, the tweeters. Probably surface mount. Yeah, that, this probably surface mount right here. Put this in here. I used to fool with all this, man. I don't deal with it no more. I take it to the shop now. Um. Yeah, there's different ways you can mount the tweeters. Different hardware for the tweeters. Yep. Oh, and there's the tweeters here. I guess. Yep. So, I'm going to take it to uh, Digital Audio. I'm in Atlanta, so I'm going to take it to Digital Audio. They hooked up my sound that I got now. This is the crossover. crossover they got two crossovers two tweeters and two woofers six and a half speakers I suppose they call them not woofers 90 watts continuous so I got a D&D &D amp I think the D&D &D amp is a four channel 75 watts times four so I think I'm gonna put all that D and D on my separates, front separates, rear separates, and uh, I was thinking about getting two more six by nines. I'm not sure I want to cut my rear dash and my my impeller though. I'm sure it would devalue it, but you know they got some custom guys that'll make it look good for me. You know. Pretty good quality. Let me see, let me take it out of the plastic. Back in the day when I was playing with the speakers and stereo equipment, we used to base the quality of the, the, the speaker we was dealing with by the magnet size. So if that's still true today, the magnets is heavy. It's a big size. I guess you could say maybe three quarters of the speaker. It's pretty cool. Put it back in the the bag put it back in the box as soon as I install them y'all gonna be the first to know uh, I dropped four videos wait I, I dropped four videos on my YouTube channel uh, GK TV if you into cars if you into bikes Sport bikes, Harleys.
like my channel, subscribe, and stay tuned. I don't think this go like this. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. Well, here we go. <clears throat> but yeah, uh, I'm just setting it up. have some fun this, this summer man uh no, that's not how it go so I'm gonna just take this off put the speaker in there yep put it back in the box like that uh, here's what we work with JBL GTO 609C 270 watts peak power 90 watts RMS so I'm gonna try to put at least 75 watts to these uh, six and a half two-way car audio component system just a little diagram of what you get in the box if you can see that Yep. They say hear the truth, so y'all stay tuned. GK TV. Like, share, subscribe. And as soon as I set these up in the 6x9, it this is me in the 6x9. As soon as I set these up in my impala in the rear doors, I'll let y'all hear it. Meanwhile, stay tuned to what I have in store. For this summer, 2020, if you like cars and bikes, that's what we do. I drive a 96 Impala SS, dark cherry metallic, and on the sport bike side, I drive a, a rider, um, 2005 Jixxon 1000, K5 they call it. So stay tuned.